Hi guys, hope everybody is doing really well today. Um, today is going to be the uh, attempt to catch up on guess the price. <laughs> I like literally a, more than a dozen guess the prices behind. My apologies, been super busy the last couple of months and I haven't really had the time to work out who's the winners. So my apologies. Now the guess the price will be coming to an end this year. Um, I think I think we've had a good fun, good run. We've had some seriously good guesses. Um, so we're going to be um, working out who the winners are and what the prizes are. I think I'm probably going to do that um, on the 1st of next year. So the 1st of um, January will be the winners of the Guess the Price. So there's going to be a couple more chances to win Guess the Price before the uh, end of it. Um, so I'm going to uh, and then I might start giving some serious points away just on the last few guesses as well. Um, so let's let's try and catch up some of the previous guess the prices where I've been absolutely miles. So the very very first thing is the teddy bear, the um, um, United States teddy bear, which I gave one to John. I found another one for Alex. Um, so I, I already sent it to Alex, so I don't have it in front of me, but it was that uh, United States of America sort of uh, teddy bear. Um, so the teddy bear. Um, I bought for three pounds um, at a fair, which I thought was quite cheap. John said that some of them are going for a lot more money than that. And the winner on that one was Resto Rob. So well done, Resto Rob. Let me find Resto Rob. Um, there's Resto Rob there. So Resto Rob, three more for you, buddy. One, two, three. We'll do the um, we'll do the we'll do that there, Resto Rob. It's not very clear. Let me move that down a bit. Yeah, that might be all right. So yeah, resto Rob, three more. Right, the the next thing is the sort of World War sort of dagger, kind of a bit of fun, and the bullet. I bought this off the same seller. Um, he wanted forty for that and twenty for that. In the end, I gave him twenty five for that and I gave him fifteen for the bullet. So it was forty pounds for the bullet. Um, and the winner of that is Tom Peace. So Tom, well done to you, buddy. Let's 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 find you. I think you might be a, one of the earlier guesses. Tom Peace, excellent guess. You guessed exactly forty. Did he guess exactly forty? Yeah, exactly forty. Bang on the nose. So I'm going to give you three for that one, Tom. So well done to you, buddy. Excellent guess. Now the next one is this. Um, I got from Finland Tools, um, which is a nice guy. Finland Tools mostly deals in woodworking stuff. Um, mostly deals in woodworking stuff, but I got this uh, really cool one off his website. It wasn't a lot of money, to be fair. It was only £28, which I thought was great. And the winner for that one was Nick H. So well done, Nick. We'll give you three. Absolutely excellent, Nick H. Top guesser. Right, the next one was these EA Berg which led me to uh, go to the chap's house, which I bought a whole big job lot, if you remember. And then about three weeks later, I got a speeding fine from the motorway for going uh, 74 or something in a 50 zone because it turned to 50 and I didn't see it because I was too excited buying tools. So I slowed down a bit too slow. So it got me a, a massive fine. Cause I'm, so I'm look, waiting for that to come through the post. But those are a really cool set of Berg pliers. And the Berg pliers um, was Jim and Jack. Both both shared that. I paid thirty pounds for the pliers. So there's Jimbo. One, two, three, and then Jack is here. One, two, three. So well done to Jack. Well done to Jim. Absolutely fantastic guesses there, buddies. Right. The the next one was this little. Um, um, sort of, I don't know what you call this little um, blowtorch or little whatever. Oh no, it's this is a tire pressure gauge, a little tire pressure gauge, and a little Lucas Oiler. Believe it or not, I paid the grand total. Where where is it at for those? Eight pounds. I paid five pounds for the Oiler, and I paid three pounds for the blowtorch. And the closest guess was. Um, Rachel Hamley and Kesley Watson, who both guessed, I'm not sure you both guessed, can't read that, 
um both get i didn't write it down anyway i think you both guess 15 if i remember correctly but i'm not quite sure so kesley watson rachel hamley well done to you so um kesley is here so one two three and rachel is here an excellent guesser rachel absolutely fantastic so well done to you guys on the blowtorch now then the next one is this little level I've been trying to buy this level. It's not very focusing, is it? There we go. I've been trying to buy this uh, EA Preston level off the guy on the car boot sale for about three years. It's got some carving in it. He originally started asking like 65 and I got down to 50, 40. In the end, I gave him 25 um, for it, which I thought was okay, not too bad. Quite nice level. Um, so, the £25 I paid for the level, let me find the level. Um, where's the level? Um, the best guess was Little Restorers. Um, and Little Restorers, this, this camera's not doing very well today, is it? Little Restorers guessed 22, so a little bit under what I paid, but still an excellent guess. Well done, Little Restorers. Um, where's little, there we are, Little Restorer. Well done, so absolutely fantastic. Um, and then the last two, we've got this blowtorch. Kind of a fun little blowtorch, if you don't say so myself. I think you put the paraffin in there and it blows out there or something, and you can add extra air in. But what was really cool about this was it was a, I don't know if you can see, this camera's doing my editing today, a Moore and Wright Sheffield, kind of nice, and it wasn't a lot of money. Um, how much did I pay for the blowtorch? I paid I paid uh, three pounds for the blowtorch, and the winner of that is Tom Peace, who guessed fifteen because everybody went stupidly high on that, and it was only three, absolute bargain. Um, so where's Tom on here? Tom Peace, another excellent guess for you, buddy. Well done, absolutely fantastic. Right, so the last one, I'm just going to take you off. The clip and show you is this record 75 vice which i got from my buddy's um collection um uh, warehouse shall i say he only charged me 20 pounds for it which was a bargain um but I'm, it's only going to stay on the shelf so thank you for that so 20 pounds let me just put you back in this clip there we go 20 pounds um, and who was the winner on the record 75. Ian the essential handyman uh, guessed 25, so only five pound out. So well done to you, Ian. Excellent, absolutely excellent guesser. Well done, so fantastic. Right, so that's the end of this guess the price. Um, some absolutely fantastic guesses. So well done to Nick H. Well done to Ian the essential handyman. Well done to um, Hand tool restoration Jimbo. Double well done to Tom Peace. Got two guesses in this one. Well done to Jack. Uh, well done to uh, Resto Rob. Well done to Rachel Hamley. Well done to Kesley Watson. And well done to Little Restorers. Absolutely fantastic. Really, 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 really good. So fantastic, fan Dabby Dozy. So let's uh, give them all a round of applause. Well done to you guys. You only got one round of applause because otherwise it'd be too many. I'm trying to catch up. So fantastic to all the guesses. Uh, massive thank you to this year for everybody who's took part in it in the guessing. Um, we've got some uh, had some really interesting tools over the last year. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Um, I'll still be doing the um, tool hauls. And I might ask the guest the price at the beginning and then say at the end, you can put it in the comments. But I won't be doing the competition next year. This is the uh, this is a one year thing. So hopefully you enjoyed it. But I might be doing some other uh, competitions with Jim and that uh, another time. So yeah, thanks to everybody on that one. We'll be, don't forget, we'll be doing another guest at uh, the Tool Hall guest the price, a bigger one. 
and then we will be um, doing a couple more new tool hauls with inflated I might do like 10 points to the winner or something I don't know but we'll figure something out all right thanks to everybody who's watching really fantastic have a great day bye